Okay guys, uh, welcome again. Today we'd like to discuss introductions of product service system or PSS. PSS it is a combination between product and service in the system. So what is PSS or product service system? It is a functions oriented business model. It's a business model developed in academia that is aimed at providing sustainability of both consumption and production. So we know that the uh, responsibility for producers is to, pro to produce or a product or to provide a product or it is in, in a state of productions and then uh, deliver to the customer so it is a state of consumptions and here uh, we will concern on the sustainability both for production and consumptions especially for the consumptions in the eye of customers so some examples here uh, are Xerox, uh, Xerox photocopy machines, uh, uh, Xerox pays per copy model for selling office equipment. It means that uh, uh, Xerox will calculate uh, the, the cost only for per copy model for selling office equipment. So the customer no needs to buy the office equipment, but uh, it is kind of renting. Okay, It is kind of rental fee. So, and then the second one is Rolls Royce powered by the our service package for aircraft engines, whereby maintenance, repairing, overhaul service are charged per hour of flights. So it is on per hour of flights. No need to buy the whole machines, but uh, in, uh, instead, uh, we uh, the company looking at the core uh, activities with this uh, hourly flight and then Atlas Cop Coast contract air service whereby air compressors are sold per meter cubic or compressed air delivered and then Philips pay per lux model for selling lighting equipment whereby customers pay for a promised level of illumines in the building then finally Michelin's fleet management solutions whereby truck tires are sold per kilometer driven so I guess uh, the whole concepts of this product service system if we look at these examples so customer only buy only pay according to the usage or according to the core activities of that offering Offering can be both product and service. So every day, many people have great ideas. Actually, this is a background that less than one over one million of these ideas will reach the marketplace. What makes the difference? Of course, the uh, the main thing is the impact. The impact for the for the users, yeah for the environment and then for the business itself and why innovations uh, are so difficult and where lies the complexity so guys this concept the innovations complexity and also PSS I think they are connected yeah. okay back to the uh, Definitions of product service system PSS. It is a marketable set of products and services capable of jointly fulfilling a, a user's needs. The underlying principles are shifting business focus from designing and selling physical products, physical products once again, only to selling a system of product and services jointly capable of fulfilling specific client or user demands so once again i repeat guys jointly capable of fulfilling specific client or user demands so 
the uh, creations of unique value propositions and it is a way to minimize inefficiencies in the system by shifting responsibility among the life cycle chains of the product so what's the meaning of responsibility shifting responsibility so for example the customer or the user no need to buy the whole package i mean the physical if we talk about physical product no, no need to uh, the customers or the the user no need to buy the whole package of physical equipment or facilities but uh, rather than they they need to or uh, yeah um, burden by the cost of usage okay cost of usage cost of core activities done by the customer so uh, regarding the maintenance regarding the uh, rejected uh, or spoiled components or um, rejected uh, products I think it is a sh uh, it is a responsibility for the producers okay so PSS it is a modular methodology in five steps so starting with a strategic analysis this is more on the company visions and also uh, company missions and strategies and then followed by exploring opportunities yeah what opportunities ahead uh, what opportunities uh, in our surroundings and then followed by the PSS idea development concept design and development and implementation of PSS project so this approach actually enables a company to start up a process at the state that is most relevant depending on the work that has already been carried out internally okay and cost efficiency for the client uh, creating value for the client and supplier saving the planet yes uh, is also related to the environmentally responsible that makes good business sense and then in fact give us a competitive advantage yeah and also partner with our customer to create solutions to their unique cleaning and hygiene needs so the keywords here are environment business and the customers yeah I think these are the concept of sustainability sustainability is related to product service and system So it is new thinking, okay? New thinking is needed. Yeah, we know that uh, the world changes rapidly, and right now we are in the uh, COVID nineteen pandemic. Of course, we need to change, right? And it is a complex relationship. It's this complex relationship, I think, is uh, quite general. We can apply this to other or too many uh, uh, problems okay and one uh, yeah this is in general we take a look at the market okay the market and then there there is a uh, the connections between producers manufacturers governments and the clients and these are external factors so from producers to the clients and also supported by the government we offer pss to the clients okay we offer product service system to the client so uh, government producer must support the delivery of pss to the client and how about the stakeholders relations yes it can be the clients our clients uh, we have customers we have employees shareholders partners and society so pss is responsible to make the harmony of uh, relationship among uh, stakeholders so if we take a look at sustainability we take a look at uh, pss we take a look at the you know the components of business component of social component of economy actually uh, they are interconnected so it's sustainability for a competitive age now we look at the environment we take a look at the economic we take a look at the socials 
and this is a triangle of sustainability. So uh, what about the economics? The keywords are efficiency, efficient use of resources. Okay, resources can be labor cost, can be uh, money, can be uh, materials, for example. And how about environment? We take a look at the stakeholder management, employee containment, minimum social standard corruptions, and how we improve the health and safety standards. And how about the uh, this one? Social aspect. Social aspect is talking about the strategic and financial planning, the quality management, knowledge management, and reputations, the governments, corporate governance, it means, and the impact to social. So they are, uh, they should be balanced. So many new global sustainability issues. We have global governance, corporate governance and accountability, sustainable management and conservation of natural resources, climate change, accessibility of water and energy, changing sustainable production and consumption patterns, trade and sustainable development, and also global uh, impact today uh, during the COVID-19 pandemic. So I think uh, it will influence the practice of PSS. Well, okay, what should we do? So we can do assessment, sustainability assessment. This is a very simple framework. So sustainable development can be branched out into three dimensions, people, planet, and profit. People is talking about social, planet is environment, and profit is about economic. If we take a look at the previous triangle, it is the same thing. And then we have categorize, we have aspects, and we have indicators. For example, how to measure people. For example, customer satisfaction, employee satisfactions. And how about the planet? Maybe the number of the percentage of waste, the profit, maybe we are talking about IRR or NPV. Yeah. So uh, there's another concept called Blue Ocean Strategies or BOS. It is a PSS thinking reinvented for marketers. So we take, uh, we start with the strategy canvas. Yeah, this is a, a formulation of strategy for action framework, eliminate risk, reduce and cre create, and formulating BOS, Blue Ocean Strategy, to building a unique PSS and executing BOS. So uh, I think the methodology is similar to the one that we have already discussed. Yeah, this is a book. Yeah, you can find this book. Actually, this book is talking about how to generate innovative ideas. So, uh, we take a look at the uh, we target to the leaders and niche players. These are the one that are full of innovators. And Peloton and Lockhart are those who are very late and they're just following what you want to do. They're just following to see what to do and then they follow you. But uh, leaders and its players, it is a uh, key players to the today's business. And we will want if uh, especially if we want to apply PSS product service system. So uh, they 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 need to break the rule. And then to set up the uh, new strategy and then to set up new ideas that uh, focusing on three aspects people planet and profit or social environment and also the uh, economy okay and this is a kind of a example of checklist uh, how we apply PSS number one is what does its PSS solution generated really offer about the functionality, perceived values, for example, and then what are the main actors involved and how should the PSS interact with the client for the solutions, and then what are the platform boundaries and how should the PSS system look like for its solutions and what PSS solution is the best to start working on, 
and what are the investment requirements and how do the ideas generated uh, bring about uh, improvement with regard to environmental or social impact I think that's all guys this is our introduction of BSS hopefully that you uh, I believe this is a new terms and you can find uh, more resources online yeah reg regarding the PSN and then try to digest this concept once again and uh, hope I hope that uh, you learn something here okay thank you and bye